Hey yo, hey yo, this is DJ Diva coming back at you with another video. Y'all, you already know we did the makeup haul try on. And of course, I love the shade. Look at that. Love the shade. I could go a little bit lighter with the concealer. But all in all, I think it's okay. Um, I'm dealing with allergies right now. So um, that is one of the reasons why I didn't want to go all in on the eyes. Um, but yeah, I'm dealing with, and if you look in my thumbnail for my makeup haul try on, you'll see that my eyes were really red. And it's because I'm dealing with allergies, but who isn't so in saying that i'm so happy that you guys are watching that you're dming me that you're sending me emails asking me different questions and stuff um smash that subscribe button please give your girl a thumbs up and a comment in the comment section um you can still you know write me an email or whatever but i do appreciate the comments in the comment section and a thumbs up let's keep this momentum going thank you for the people who have subscribed welcome to the new ones who have not yet subscribed that are just checking out my channel girl what you waiting on click that subscribe button and let's keep this family growing vaseline it's time to take the makeup off y'all don't forget, Vaseline is an old, tested, tried, true, there's nothing like it. You can get Vaseline anywhere. Doesn't have to be the brand name Vaseline. Petroleum jelly. The petroleum, baby. And you really want to massage that in. Everywhere you put makeup at, massage it, massage it, massage it. Okay. Okay. Now, I'm gonna get some paper teal. And I'm going to go in and wipe, wipe, slow and easy. I don't want to scrape up my face or if it is paper towel, it's not, and it's industrial paper towel. So I don't want to scratch up my face. Look how easy that comes off with that Vaseline or petroleum jelly, whichever you prefer to call. Look at that. Ugh. It's important in order to keep your skin supple, wrinkle free, clean, acne free. You don't want to clog your pores. You don't want to clog them pores, creating pimples or anything like that. First, you have to really go in there and get as much, as much, look at that, you guys, as much as that makeup, that foundation, that, you know, it's layers of it. Mascara. You know, that it's layers of it. You got the eyeshadows, you got the primer, you got the foundation, the concealer, the powders. Look at that. Get it all. Easy, slow, and with a soft hand. 
We do not want to mess up any of the tissue. Now your skin is just an organ and it will absorb whatever you put in there. Just like the rest of your body. Take vitamins and stuff. Your organs will absorb that. Look at all that. Yeah. Let's get that. And then after you do that step, I have my hot water right in this and what you want to do is I got a antibacterial cleaner, soap, and I'm going right on in there. It's going to get all that. And let me give y'all a tip. Dawn dish liquid is the bomb. If it can get the grease and gunk out of the animals that have swam in the ocean and got polluted, like the ducks and stuff, and get all that oil and grease. Although, what I'm using now is not Dawn, Dawn's green, but whenever I want to deep clean my locks even, and get all that gunk and stuff out of there, I do use Dawn when I'm really detoxing my locks. Don't use it very often, maybe once every two months, but chow. Don't sleep it. Okay, I'm rinsing. And I do see makeup coming off in the water. You see, I got the raccoon eyes and stuff. It's time. Give me two more pumps. Time to go in again. I never really get all of the mascara, and that's okay because I wear it every day, regardless if if I have a full face of makeup or not. Now I do this twice. With lukewarm water. Right now I have lukewarm. And then I'm going to go in with my rag. I only exfoliate my face once a week. And I reserve that for Mondays. Okay. But the, um, the washcloth gives like an, an exfoliation all of itself. So, I go in with a, my water a little bit hotter this time. As hot as I can stand it, okay? Then I go in. And I clean. Now tomorrow is my another facial day for me, so I'm not gonna go in with a mask today. That'll be for tomorrow. And I like to do upward circular motions. That neck is an extension that you, you know, that's where you put that makeup in also, so you must get that neck everywhere you put that foundation in to blend. Make sure you get that. The worst thing I've ever seen on a woman is when she has bumps underneath her chin all the way down her neck. And I know a lot of people mistake it for hair bumps. That's not it. It's because the skin is clogged sometimes. Sometimes it is hair bump because people don't know how to properly shave or pluck. And it leaves those darkened areas. But 
You can get rid of that stuff. You can get rid of it. This takes a little bit of time and a little bit of work, okay? And I am just a smidge lighter than the makeup I tried on, but like I said, it's the exact same color I use during the summer months. And that's what I like to stick with all year round. Um, I'm not going to be buying all different kinds of foundation and trying to stick with oh this one's winter this must no I'm just gonna do my summer shade all year round give me some nice color okay I have to tell you the last bit of water that I used to wipe my face was cool so it seals in any moisture okay and since your girl for whatever reason, because I didn't have it as a teen, I never had any facial issues. But your girl is suffering a little bit of acne, so I will put some acne cream on. Um, yeah. Let me give you a face, honey. Do you see I'm suffering a little bit of acne in my T-zones? Hormones. <laughs> that time of the month. Curfew. That's the fire engine. Uh, fire. Fire station alarm. There's a fire somewhere. Thank you, Lord. It's at not at my crib. That is it, you guys. That is the nighttime routine where I take off my makeup when I wear it. So, yeah, and I do, I do wear, um, I do wash my face at least three times in the morning and at night. Um, I don't do it in the middle of the day because I'm usually working and I usually have makeup on. Even with my mask these days, I put a little something on, you know, just to zhuzh it up and give me a little bit of color. But yeah, and my little bit of acne comes and goes each month. You know, I'm dealing with that hormone changes, I guess, around that time. But, you know, I never had issues with it before. But yeah, so I just wanted to show you, you know, after my application of makeup, how I take it off at night in order to, you know, keep a somewhat smooth complexion and uh, prevent my pores and stuff from being cl clogged and, you know, what I do to keep sort of a fresh face look, you know. So, yeah. So what I'll do is I'll go in there and I'll put my little bit of acne medicine in my T-zones, put me some lip gloss on, and call it a night. So in saying that, you guys, I love you. Love you to life. I want you to act blessed, talk blessed, walk blessed, and be a blessing to who? You better be a blessing to the Lord by blessing somebody else. And please, hashtag stay safe, hashtag stay home. Hashtag stay prayed up and hashtag stay clean. Hashtag stay alive. I love you to life. Please smash that like and subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment in the comment section. Until then, until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.
This is DJ Diva. And I'm out.